I'm gonna try to hit this intro in one shot. <laughs> Here we go. In today's video, what we're gonna do is take a closer look at the De'Aaron Fox Sacramento Kings City Edition jersey. So the jersey design is actually incorporating core features from four past jerseys, three or four, and infuse it into one, and this is the outcome in this City Edition jersey. So in today's video, what I'm gonna do is unbox the jersey, take a closer look at the finer details, and hopefully help you decide if you wanna purchase this or pass on it. If you guys find this video helpful, an easy way to support the channel is just by hitting like. If you want to hit subscribe, go ahead. And if we have a notification bell as well so you don't miss out when I drop new content. Let's just go ahead and unbox this jersey. Whew, man, I usually edit so much. All right, so I bought this at fanatics.com for 110 bucks. De'Aaron Fox is having a pretty quietly great season. All right, they packaged it in a little Ziploc bag, and here we go. Boom. All right. We got Sacramento. We got the, ooh, that checkered. You see that checkered? Oh, man, I already know which jersey it's coming from. And then we got De'Aaron Fox. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at it. All right, let's go ahead and start off at the collar. So you got a baby blue collar with the red stripe that goes through. So when the Kings first moved to Sacramento, they actually had the baby blue. And when they started in Rochester as the Rochester Royals, they actually wore red. So that's a combination of a couple different jerseys. Then we go to the NBA logo. It's a swingman, so it's heat pressed. And we go to a numbering, a gigantic five, and that is heat pressed as well. Then we go to Fox. So that is also heat pressed. Then you can kind of see the side panels from the back. You can see that checkered uniform. That is representing the old 90s like split jersey. They had like a black and purple. So they had a checkered design. So that's actually sublimated onto the jersey. And then you can kind of see a separate polyester piece that is stitched together. It's like baby blue and red. So it gives it like a contrast in colors and it's on that other side panel as well. And that is the back of the jersey. So back to the collar in the front, same type of deal. Then you got the arm opening as well. And then when we go to the neck label, this is an XL. Go to the tags, we got the NBA, dry fit, standard fit, recycle. Ah, they slipped up on this one. They usually have the retail price on here. But I got it from Fanatics, so it's all good. And then we got the Nike swoosh, nice and heat pressed. Then we got Sacktown for Sacramento. You got a baby blue base with the red outline. All heat pressed throughout the jersey. And then you have the baby blue number five going down to the jock tag so standard stuff right here you know you got your typical swing man nike swoosh and then we got sacramento proud that's printed onto the jersey nice little extra feature then we go to the side panels kind of similar to the back you can really see the checkered design right here real nice and that is the front of the jersey and that was a closer look at the jersey what do you guys think let me know in the comments below you get one last look of it i think it's a really nice looking jersey i mean it didn't get as much hype as like the other team's city edition jerseys but i like how it's well thought out they blend different colors from past jerseys like the red is from the the rochester royals the baby blue is when they first came to sacramento and then the whole checkered pattern from the 90s design that split. I like that feature because I'm biased. I really like that jersey. But they also have that classic black that we're used to watching them wear. So this is actually really nice. And I like how it makes these other colors make everything pop. But I can't wear it. It's a size XL. I'm going to actually list this on our eBay store. So if you guys are interested, check it out. I think I'm going to price it a little less than retail. And uh, man, if you guys want to support the channel, we got affiliate links down below in the description. And this is it. All right, next, on to the next video, guys.